Hey everyone, I've got kind of an interesting project today. I'm gonna cut this western red cedar down and take it up to the mill and cut it into one by sixes that are gonna be used inside of concrete forms to uh, give a texture to a concrete wall on a building that's being built uh, in Portland. It's for the same contractor that I'm doing all the other work for. So let's get started. I didn't film the recovery of that that log because uh, this isn't a comedy channel and uh, it was a little much for my little tractor so it was a fight but anyways point is I got it so let's cut it up Okay, come on. 
Now the purpose of these boards that I'm cutting is to simulate the appearance of old-fashioned board formed concrete walls and the grain pattern left in the concrete is uh, what we're going for so with a slightly dull blade I can pull the grain up uh, on each cut so I'm gonna check on my face cuts and make sure that I'm just pulling up the grain and I'm not leaving saw marks uh, in the wood because that's not what we want so uh, if need be I'll make a cut and change to one of my other blades I used on that other wood that's still sharp enough to cut cedar. Um, it just wasn't sharp enough to leave the smooth finish we were looking for on the wood paneling uh, from the other day. It's pretty much 25 by 25. I'm gonna have to whittle at this end a little bit. Normally I like to have the butt end at the other end of the saw, but <clears throat> I really didn't have an option uh, to get that thing turned around. So. We're gonna whittle this down and uh, get it to where I can make it uh, a six inch wide cant. Well, there doesn't seem to be marks from the blade, but there's these imperfections. They're not cracks. There's soft wood in them. I don't know what's going on. I'll have to see if I can work around that. It's almost like heart rot was starting. I love sawing cedar. It is beautiful, it smells good, and it cuts like butter. Now these boards that I'm sawing are actually for a repair in the concrete wall that was poured last summer. And I need to exactly duplicate the boards that were used last year. So I'm gonna get a measurement off of these. These are a couple pieces they had left over. Just under five and a half by three quarters. The camera, silly. Huh? The camera.
Now I need 11 of these 1x6s to fill the order. I've cut 16, hoping that out of those 16 I can pick out 11 that don't have any of that imperfection in it. So I'm going to look through them right now and see what we've ended up with, see if I need to cut some more or not. I think compared to what they used originally and what I've made, I think they'll be pretty happy. It's about as identical as you can get. Tomorrow's Friday and I have the day off. I think I'm gonna spend it cleaning up this week's worth of mess I've made. You love sawdust? <laughs> 